Yeah. Frank Sexton. Yeah. And actually, this is, you want to hold that up, Mark? Our dad used to have this, a sweater. When he passed, our stepmother made us each a pillow. My brother and our sister, we all have a pillow. So that's pretty cool for my dad. And then one year, the year with the rain, this one, I guess, this button with the rain, um, Neil's going, nobody can wear, hum nobody can use umbrellas, nobody can wear covers on their hats, or anything like that. And he's giving me shit, and I go, D and this was the year after my dad died. I go, Mike, this is my dad's Tam, and I'm honoring him. I'm not, and I had it covered with a, a shower cap, so it was clear. And I go, I'm not taking it off. And he goes, fair enough. So He was by with my dad. Too. Yeah. So actually those guys, talking about my dad, so... He was, he was he was uh, Irishman of the Year in uh, 2009. Yeah, 2009. he died two years later. Yeah. So at his wake, actually, um, the Hall brothers, you know, the group was there, and and and, and uh, Mike Reedy, Mike Reedy, and then in case trio, exactly. And yeah. then uh, Mike Neal gets up, and they're singing, they singing some song, and there were uh, this is at the wake, celebration of life. They get a, and my stepmother gets a conga line going with those guys playing. So there's a lot of friendly stuff, you know, there. So it was pretty hilarious when you think about it. But, uh, I mean, I would say the best wake we've been to is my dad's wake, right? I mean, it, it came well, you know, because, play. yeah. You know, I would never have asked, and Mike Reedy really said, would you like us to play? At the wake, I said, "You're shitting me. We'd love to have you." You know, that was it, unbelievable. It was so great and very cool. Really fun, and they did a great job. And all these guys that my dad knew from the Irish community got up and spoke about it. it was very cool. You know. Mostly guys he'd uh, represent in DUIs. There's a lot of that. <laughs> well, that's if you go to the old sod. He's like a god there because. Uh, Tommy was getting deported, and my dad, I don't know, but remember that story, but no, he got him off of that one, and he said, and Tommy said,